It's your girl, Misty. I have a question for you. Are you in a committed waxing relationship? Because I am with my clients. <laughs> you should be in a committed waxing relationship with your wax lady or your wax person. My clients come and see me at least once or twice a month for their waxing services or their facial treatments. You know, we send texts throughout the month for encouragement. Sometimes we just need, you know, good old fashioned girl talk or dinner dates. So you should build that type of relationship with your esthetician because they should know what's going on with your skin, not just, you know, when you come in for your service, but you should prep them for what's going on. Having a great relationship with your esthetician is definitely important because, you know, as women, we go through different things throughout the month. We have our monthly periods, we have, you know, irritation, we have discharge, things like that, which definitely matters when you're coming in for your wax. So being able to explain that to your esthetician and tell her like, hey, this is what's going on with me. When I deal with my clients, I can kind of tell when they're, have, when they're already irritated. And I ask questions, you gotta be able to ask questions. So that's when I say, you have to build a relationship with your esthetician because you wanna be able to ask questions. I love that my clients call me their wax wives because they know that they can come in here and talk to me about anything, whether it's about skin, whether it's about life, about their boyfriends, husbands, um, even my guys. It's building that relationship with clients so they feel comfortable when they come in here to talk to you just about anything. You know, having a relationship with your clients, you you can be straightforward with them. You know, I, I tell my clients straight up, I know you haven't been exfoliating because I can totally tell you got ingrowns all over the place, you got blackheads all over. I want them to have that trust with me where they can come in and say, you know what, see, I haven't been exfoliating. I, I didn't buy the pussy cat scrub. Um, I didn't um, have time, whatever the case is. You know, when you come to Sachet Wax, I am not a franchise business. I'm a small business. I'm a single mom. I'm an entrepreneur. So when you come here, it's not just about me waxing you and taking your money. I really do care about you, not just your skin, but your whole well-being. So I do call my clients, you know, my friends, my confidants, my, my, my girlfriends. Some of them have turned out to be some of my closest best friends. I like to have that open door policy with clients where they feel comfortable enough to not just lay on my table and spread a meagle, but <laughs> being able to come to me in confidence and confidentiality where um, they feel comfortable enough to tell me things that they wouldn't want me to tell everyone else. You know, I, I, I can think of clients um, when I'm at home or if I'm at the grocery store and I send text messages to them to say, you know, I hope you're staying on top of your exfoliation, I hope you're moisturizing. Everyone's, you know, uh, schedule and their service can be customized. But for some reason, I just, I remember and I have that relationship with my clients where I can remember and I have notes on what they need to use and what they need to do. But, you know, I love that they're committed to me. I'm committed to them. We're, we're loyal to each other and that's why you know, they end up with great results and, you know, we have that same goal of getting their skin to be, you know, healthier and clearer. Um, and it just works out for the both for the for the both of us. So having a, a, a committed waxing relationship where you're sticking to, you know, one esthetician, you know, my clients, they may cheat on me once in a while. That's only because they're out of state and you know they've been out the country and they, they needed to get waxed somewhere else. That's the only time I'll allow them to cheat on you. You know, there's levels to this. I definitely want to encourage all of you to build a relationship with your esthetician, be in a committed waxing relationship, and you're more than welcome to come down at Sashay Wax here in Beverly Hills and just try me out. So that's it for today, guys. Um, if you like what you saw and you like the information that you received, um, click on the link below, subscribe to my channel, um, and definitely leave a comment and let me know if there's something else that you guys want to talk about. If there's any other topics that you're concerned about, um, if you're a virgin waxer, if you're an existing waxer, definitely just let me know.